What's going on, ball hunters? I'm Big Bad Dirty Dog coming to you from the Dog Pound. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, or good night, depending on when you're watching this. Hope you're all having a fantastic day. Hope you're all having an amazing year. We are back here on Borderlands 3, and it's Thursday, and you know what that means. Maurice's Black Market Vending Machine Reset Day. I try saying that five times real fast. So if you don't know who Maurice is, he's a reptilian friend you can find on Sanctuary who for some reason has his own vending machine which is scattered throughout the universe that's only in base game so you don't have to worry about if you don't own any DLC because it'll never be in any DLC and it kind of spawns in random locations and changes every Thursday it contains legendary weapons, legendary shields, and legendary grenades so with further ado let's get right into it so for this week you're going to spawn on Pandora and from there you're going to travel to the Splinterlands and then from there you're going to want to go to Pit Stop and then you're going to want to come over here and grab a vehicle and just kind of follow them away. It's not too far to go. Just a quick hop, skip and a jump over to here. But you're going to need a really good build because you're going to face some heavy opposition this week. A lot of badasses, a lot of anointing. I mean I went down several times and it's pretty far back into this area right here. Let me zoom out here so you can kind of see. I'll spin around so you can kind of get familiar with where you're at. Make sure you're in the right location. Just like right across from that satellite dish is going to be Melissa's Black Market vending machine. So hopefully, uh, and as always, I haven't watched any videos. I have no idea what's in there. So let's hope that Mo has something good for us this week. Okay, the stuffed quadomizer rocket launcher. I mean, torques are pretty good. I'm not really a fan of this rocket launcher. It's all right. Has a good anointment on it, and radiation is always fun to play with. A boring gun. It lives up to its name. It's a decent shotgun. A lot better options. Again, radiation, not too bad. Not a bad anointment there. Good anointments. and the transformer shield which is uh, really good when you're going up against enemies with shields and you can see it's 100% shock resistance it's one of my favorite shields in the game and you can see it converts 100% of shock damage into shields and it absorbs bullets and not, some not bad anointments either so I would say the transformer is probably the best thing in the vending machine this week like I said, I'm not really a big fan of the boring gun or the quadimizer, but again, it depends on what your build is. If you build around these weapons, they can be halfway decent. But I would say the Transformer Shield is a definite pickup for you this week. So I'm going to give this one... I'll be nice, I'll give it a 7 out of 10 this week. Let me know in the comments below, how do you feel about this week's vending machine? Are you going to get anything out of there? Let me know how you rate it out of 1 to 10. So that's going to do it for today's video. As always, love and appreciate all of you that take the time to watch, comment, and like my videos. It means the world to me. Much love to all your beautiful faces. If you are enjoying the content, make sure you smash that like and subscribe button as it helps me out tons. So until next time, stay awesome, stay amazing, stay wonderful, stay fantastic, and as always, stay beautiful, my friends.